There are many different ways that wildlife can find shelter or a home in trees, but perhaps none look quite so bizarre as these little structures here. These are called galls, and essentially it's the swelling of the plant tissue caused by either fungi or an insect. These particular galls are known as oak galls, and they're caused by a tiny wasp, commonly known as a gall wasp, and they will stab into the plant tissue with an ovipositor and deposit an egg. And then that egg will develop into a larva, which will not only feed on the plant tissue, but it'll also cause the tree to form tissue growth around it, creating this sort of capsule or a pod for the larva to develop in. And that gall will become home for the larva, providing a source of food and protective shelter. And then as the tree heads into dormancy, along with the leaves and the acorns, it will fall to the ground. And there is where it will overwinter in its somewhat insulated home. And then in the springtime, the adult wasp will emerge, find a mate, and the cycle repeats. There are thousands of different species of gall wasps, creating a variety of odd and peculiar looking structures. And as alien as these things look, they're generally speaking, not harmful for the host plant. And the wasps aren't really a threat to us either. They do not sting humans. But massive infestations year after year could eventually stress the tree out. And that's when secondary pests could move in. And if that were the case, then you would remove the fallen leaves and acorns in the autumn and dispose of the debris. But overall, oak galls are an interesting oddity to find. So the next time you're walking past an oak tree, take a closer look and see if you can find yourself an oak gall.